Hello everybody, um, today I'm going to be playing Hexagon Force, a, um, the, a level in Geometry Dash. This is the last of the main levels that I've not beaten yet, so I'm just going to hop right into it. If you enjoy, make sure to like and subscribe, and tell me down below, uh, what Geometry Dash level should I play? Um, I think that'll be pretty cool. I actually kind of do like the, uh, the doubles gimmick in this game. It's just a, just a very fun gimmick. That ball part just that ball part just sucks. Yeah, um so by the time we're recording this, the new Scarlet and Violet trailer released earlier. And the games look incredible. Um, I'm actually now contemplating which version I should get. I was originally going to go with Scarlet, and then I saw the Legends, and I'm like, dang, I kind of prefer the Violet Legend. So I'm going to wait to see what version exclusive Pokemon we have, because version exclusive Pokemon will sway my opinion in which, which game I'm going to get. Though, with the Professor, is probably going to go with Violet. I think it's cool that we're getting two different professors, and the rival looks pretty fun. Uh, and then in terms of just like the multiplayer side of things, I think that's going to be fun to mess around with, having four people just run around the region at the same time and be able to freely trade. It's going to make completing the uh, Pokedex way easier and way more fun rather than the old ways of, you know, praying that you get online. Because, fun fact, Wycom kind of sucks. I, I don't know if you guys know this, but in Sword and Shield, there's this thing called Wycom, and it is the worst Wi-Fi connection I've ever seen, because you trade with people, and 90% of the Pokemon traded on there are hacked legendaries and bad eggs. I do not want hack legendaries and bad eggs. Yeah, the, um, but the new legendaries look cool. They're meant to represent, I guess, past and future tradition versus modern society. So that, that looks like fun. Uh... Yeah. I am planning on trying to do some Pokemon stuff on the channel soon, playing through every game with a little challenge for each one. We'll see how that goes. The challenge Pokemon runs are pretty fun overall, so we'll try them out. That ball part, man, that just tilts me so much.
go. Everything's fine. Everything is perfectly fine. Literally just getting tilted right now. Like, dude, seriously? Seriously? Alrighty then, that was... What was even that? That's how I feel when playing these games sometimes. Just, what was even that? Going well so far. <sighs> That's like the hardest part of this level. Because after that, it's just some tight jumps and ship segments and those are really not that bad. It's just the ball segment that sucks. Also, yes, I do go for the coin every time, even if I fail. Because getting that coin is funny. Why, dude? Come on.
Sorry about that, uh... Technical difficulties with that portion. Ending ship segment, man. That that part just sucks. That just sucks so much. I'll do a couple more attempts, and I'm probably gonna call it a day for this run. My heart is my heart's beating so freaking fast right now. actual attempt or not. Nope, it's not. the clicks I don't know I'm gonna I'm gonna do 20 attempts we're gonna do that and then I will end the video unless I get another really good attempt then might go for one more we'll see we'll see you know it would help if uh, if it registered me clicking that would help a lot in making sure that I don't die. Alright, this will be the final attempt for now. I'll probably come back to this in uh, another video. And that's it. Thank you guys all so much for watching. Uh, once again, make sure to like and subscribe to check out more of my content. And as always, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.